Hey everyone, April 79 here, and today I'm going to show you how you can get an emulator on your Google Chrome operating system. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm going to go to the Chrome Google App Store, and then I'm going to type in GBA. And as you can see, it says I added this one. It's called VBA-M. I'll leave this direct link in the description for you. And then I'm going to this website. It's coolrom.com. And I'm going to search for a ROM. So right now I'm just going to search for a Pokemon ROM that I don't have yet. And it does Game Boy Advance. So I'm going to look for a Game Boy Advance or I can just click Game Boy Advance so all the games I look at are in Game Boy Advance and I'm gonna look at getting Pokemon Fire Red um, I'm gonna click download now you have to scroll down to see it first mm this little window will pop up it says click to play the video below and your button will appear sometimes you have to let the video play for a little bit before it'll count it changes with every video sometimes it pops as soon as you hit play sometimes it doesn't and if it doesn't show up all you have to do is go back, click download now a second time. And you can just wait. And then it says download your file. So you click that, and it says Pokemon Fire Red dot zip, and then you, they're usually not that big. They're usually no more than about seven. This one is five. And then you're gonna let that download, and you're gonna want to open up your files. Okay, now that you see it's done, it's in your files right here as a zip. You double click it, and then you see Pokemon Fire Red GBA. You click and hold and pull it over into Downloads, and it just copies it into Downloads. See, there it is. Then you right click, rename, and all you do is you take the space out right there so there it is and this Pokemon Fire Red dot zip you can delete that after you have the Fire Red dot GBA up here then after you install the VBA you can go into it say press control O then you click Pokemon Fire Red GBA and there you have it. It'll, it'll load up and it will have sounds. I usually just mute it because that's what I do. And here it is, the game. You can play it and everything. And you can also play it offline as long as you download the rant the files and you leave them locally so that's how you do that thank you for watching I will leave this link and the link to the website in the description thank you so much for watching